Hi, this is Jim at your Jiffy Customer Support Network. In this segment, we're going to show you the proper procedure for changing out the carburetor on the Jiffy Model Pro 4 light engine. The first thing we're going to want to do is remove the throttle control lever from the operator handle. The Phillips screwdriver, we just want to back that screw out that holds that lever in place. Second step we're going to want to take is remove the air cleaner cover. Set that aside then take out the foam element. Then we'll go ahead and remove the air cleaner back plate retention nuts. Set those aside. We'll use this all for reassembling everything. Put the second one off here. I'll go ahead and remove the back plate retention clamp. Then we'll slide the air cleaner back plate off. We'll then have to take off the gasket that goes between the air cleaner back plate and the muffler. And the carburetor, I mean. And we'll go ahead and slide the carburetor off the mounting studs of the unit. The next step we're going to want to take is remove the throttle lever or control cable from the mounting plate on the carburetor. We want to take the cable out of the slot on the throttle lever itself and we'll just go ahead and unscrew the throttle cable from the bracket on the side of the carburetor. Set that aside. Then we'll want to remove the fuel delivery system from the top of the carburetor. The next step now that we've got the new carburetor to mount back on the engine, we're going to want to mount the fuel delivery system. All you want to do is start the threads in the carburetor and turn the carburetor clockwise onto the fuel delivery system. And again with the use of a crescent wrench. back in position toward the throttle side of the carburetor. Next thing you want to do is remount the throttle cable to the plate on the side of the carburetor and you want to screw that clockwise on until you see approximately two threads come out the top through the top of the bracket. And you're going to want to tighten this jam nut that's on the bottom of the bracket. That positions that cable in the right position to get the right throttle lever movement. Then you'll want to go ahead and mount the cable back in the slot on the throttle lever. You'll note that the slot in the throttle lever post there's a, a round opening in one end of them and you want to make sure that the ball on the end of the throttle cable fits in that wider end of the slot. Just make sure that functions properly. Then we'll want to reroute the handle with the throttle lever back through the handle. And making sure that the carb gasket between the cylinder and the carburetor is in position. We want to slide the carburetor back on the mounting studs. Then we'll want to put the gasket that goes between the air cleaner back plate plate the carburetor back in position. And we want to 
make sure the breather tube here goes back into the back of the air cleaner. Slide that back in the tube up on top. Slide the back plate on. And we want to put the retention clamp back in position. And we want to retighten or remount the air cleaner back plate retention nuts. Snug those up nice and tight. Put the air cleaner element back in position, or air fruit element. And then remount the air cleaner. And we'll want to go ahead and remount the throttle lever back up on the handle. that up till it's nice and snug. Again just making sure that the throttle lever here works with the throttle lever on the carburetor. All functions well. And that basically concludes the proper procedure for changing out the carburetor on the Jiffy model Pro 4 Lite unit. If anyone has any questions or concerns regarding this procedure, please feel free to contact us at 1-800 344-0712. I'd like to take this time to thank you for your continued support of Jiffy products and also the purchase of your Jiffy Ice Drill. Thanks and have a great day.